Thanks, Sajman. Love you. <laughs> uh, but where was? Yeah. So what's up? What's up, Twitch? Uh, it's your boy Matab Rar. I'm back doing this shit again. Um, so what we're gonna do today is something different. Um, we're gonna be doing a live reading. Oh yeah, Sashman, uh, do you wanna join, uh, wanna join what we're doing today? Uh, you have to be on, uh, Discord and do, uh, voice thing if you wanna join in. You down? But today we're doing something pretty fun. We're gonna be doing a live reading of the Powerpuff Girls, um, the Powerpuff Girls, um, thing. The fucking, fucking, the script from the... The live action thing that CW was making. Also, CW, um, I, I still love you guys. I want to work with you guys again. I worked with you guys for your Nancy Drew thing. I want to work with you guys again. So please do not hate me. This is just for fun. I want to have a partnership with you guys again because that was a great time. Um, so, right here, we have the Powerpuff Girls uh, script. It is... Uh, Quite a doozy from everything that I've read. Uh, hold on, let me just, uh, da -da. Oh, yo, Monique, what's up, man? What's up? What's good? What's good? So, right now, I have some people to help us with this, uh, extravaganza. <laughs> Go top, bro. That is beautiful. I love it. And I have my boys here today. To help me out with this, you know, we have my buddy No Home. No Home, what's up, buddy? Yo, ha ha ha! We got my boy No Home up here. Uh, he's the host of the Most Wanted Podcast. Sir, talk about yourself. Uh, can you hear me first off? Yes, I can. I that was good with y'all, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> okay, 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 okay. My fault, my fault. Um, yeah. So I've been chilling with my boy Matab, you know. Uh, I've been doing the Most Wanted podcast since about October. Been my boy since what was it now? First year of uni. Yeah, we out here. We just chilling. We vibing right now. Dead ass. We all have been vibing. Cause that's what the bra hype is. Just all. Vibes. Of course. All right. Who else is in this? Uh, uh, yo, Jihad. What's up, man? What is good, homies? Uh, introduce yourself as well. Uh, what to do? My name is Jihad. I I am Twitter homies with both the homies in chat. Even though I've never met either of them IRL, I fuck <laughs> with their shit. Um, but yeah, I, mean, I, I don't really like you, but like, you know, it's, I mean, the homes I, the homes I, but you're like, you're, you're pretty mid. I ain't gonna cap. I ain't gonna cap. And I, and, and uh, I just suck in general, but I, I'm just, I'm just there, you know? Yeah. But you know, yeah, mid exactly. is what I aim for. So I'm not taking it as a compliment. I'm taking, or I'm not taking it as a diss. I'm taking it as a compliment on my accuracy. Uh, I, but yeah, okay, yeah, you so, got it, you got it. So yeah, <laughs> I stream. I also am a, a movie nerd, like some of the homies in here. I went to film school as well, so, so we're uh, we're 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 gonna tear this shit up, I think. Ah, oh, that's nice, that's nice. And finally, we have my boy Aiden Hyten. Are you you're muted, man? If you're there, he's in the chat, Hello. right? Yeah, he's yeah, here. he's in here. Yo, so, someone message him, uh, just say unmute. Is it Hello? Oh, there you are. I can introduce yourself. Hello. We can like... Uh, there we go. There we are. Alright, sir, introduce yourself to the Twitch stream. Me? Yes. Hi, um, I'm Aiden, and I am a Tops friend. That's all you need. To know. Yeah, he's not that special. He's been a few. He's been a few bra hive stuff. So that's also I'm one of the viewers of the stream. I just want to point that. Out. <laughs> Word. I've got it open. <laughs> I love it. I love it. <laughs> all right. So you got you guys all have the script in front of you. Unfortunately. Word. All right. So, I have not read through this whatsoever. I feel like that will ruin it. So, I feel like this is a good way for all of us to experience the shittery of this together. Yeah, that's fair. I've, that's I've fair. seen a little, uh, little snippets on, on 
Twitter, and what I have not, what I have read has been all kinds of terrible. I can't wait. Oh. <laughs> I uh, missed like a minute there. I didn't hear anything. <laughs> Actually, wait. I'm just gonna go on LTE. Fuck it. Ooh, big spender. Yeah, I know. This is probably gonna cost so much. <laughs> that's true support. That's that's a real homie. Oh, I love to see it. Uh yeah. So um, all I think all I've seen about this is just like someone saying. Yeah, if you like the Powerpuff Girls shit, you're gonna hate this. Like on Cartoon Network, you're gonna hate this. Mm-hmm. Oh god! All right, this is oh, uh, it for a live action. I grew up with Powerpuff Girls, so they the way that I've heard and I've seen like a page or two off of Twitter. So this shit is about to ruin my childhood. I guarantee it. Ah, uh, dude, my childhood was ruined when I saw Dragon Ball uh, Evolution. Oh, okay. Listen, <laughs> I used Avatar. Actually- it was the last yeah. Airbender for me. Listen, listen, listen. Before I actually got into, like, serious watching anime, I thought that the Dragon Ball Evolution movie was decent. And then when I watched the anime, I was like, what the fuck was I thinking in terms of the movie? I was like, Why did I think this was decent in any stretch of the imagination? Why did I got Piccolo doing drugs as if he's some <laughs> hardline crack addict? I was Dude, actually mad, bro. So this is funny because Aiden doesn't watch any anime whatsoever. So this is- Yeah, I'm uncultured. <laughs> Okay, bro. You'll get cultured with time. I've been trying to get into watch anime for like ever. I've Wait. tried. I actually tried. I don't know why. I just don't. I just I got off a session of forcing it. my friend to watch Doctor Stone, like literally right now. How do you? My what? favorite one the Matab showed me was the One Punch Man because it was kind of a joke. <laughs> yeah, One Punch Man is pretty good. Season one. I heard season one was better than season two. I've seen season one, but I haven't seen season two yet. yet. So I'm just basing that off of what people have said. Season two is apparently less good than season one, based off of what I've heard. Dude, my CPU is running at a is a hundred percent right now, and this is a this is beautiful. That, that's not a good thing, is it? It's not. <laughs> I'm streaming off a MacBook Pro. What year? Uh, this is a 2018 MacBook Pro. It should be okay, but like because I have like. Uh, the audio setup, uh, my external camera right over here, and like, yeah, it's, it's, a whole, it's a whole batch of fuckery right now, to be honest. That's so cool. I you should, like that, wouldn't be like that, though. I'm probably gonna get a streaming PC eventually, maybe. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see. I mean, I'll help you build one. Oh, bless. But the thing is, like, um, I don't want to buy a streaming PC, because, like, I'm not gonna use it for anything other than games because like i edit on final cut for all my videos and movies so i'm like I, i'm gonna buy some get something just like this chill not doesn't i didn't over top it's dumb for me i used to do the same thing and then i sold my macbook and switched to the adobe programs to be honest uh dude i, I, I was on the adobe program for basically like for like 10 years and then i discovered final cut fell in love and it has oh, been my. It really good. I, I I love Final Cut. Like I'm good with I'm good at like I'm good at like uh, After Effects all that kind of stuff. But I just hate it. I hate it all. Yeah, I saw that little Dicky music video thing you made. <laughs> Thank you. Where you uh, cloned your ass a few times. I think I was I saw that. I'm like, well, I already like this person. <laughs> and that was all with Final Cut. I didn't use any After Effects for that shit. <laughs> I figured. I figured it was probably just. But clipping the uh, green or the same footage, just like half and half of the shot at the same time, kind of thing. Yeah, just simple masks, and then I'm just doing some, yeah. just some quick color grading so it doesn't look fake. Yeah, so it doesn't look like your particles are disappearing in one side. <laughs> yeah. All right. So, uh, so, uh, because I haven't not read this, I also don't know which characters are here. But I think each of us should take one of the main characters and just go along with the other random characters. Uh, Ian, who do you want to be? Do you want to be uh, which of the Powerpuff Girls, or do you want to be the dad? Uh, uh I kind of want to be the dad. Like, all right, Aiden's daddy. Yeah. All right, Jihad, what about you? Fuck, I forget their names. Which one's the <laughs> the one with the green green eyes? That's Buttercup. Buttercup. Yeah. Buttercup. That's what I thought. I'm going with Buttercup. All right, no home. What about you? You already know we're rocking Team Red. We're rocking Blossom right now. I bet. I got Bubbles. And Bubbles is also my screen name on uh, Club Penguin for the longest time. So it works. 
How did you get this script? I'm looking online for it, and it's not like easily found. On Dude, it is not yeah, easy. Get this. It's Reddit. <laughs> oh yeah. I literally found it on Reddit, and I sent it to the top immediately. I'm like, it's probably gonna get deleted real soon. So here you go, bro. Dude, this sh like I was looking online for like 20 minutes. I couldn't find it. I put it on Twitter, and then Nahome blessed me. So bless this man every day. It's hot pause, but like I get it, appreciate it, but pause. Nah, we're in the Brar Hive. We don't pause. <laughs> I hit myself. How do I unsub again? <laughs> <laughs> I bet. Have you fun. can't even make that joke yet. <laughs> you know what, Jihad? You want to let me have my amusement or not? <laughs> Bro, I'll unmod you from my stream so fast. <laughs> Acting like I won't bitch smack what's left of the melanin off of you. I don't have much left. I do need it. Exactly. Exactly. I, so, you I, know... Silence is a virtue right now. All right, homie court adjourned. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, so I, I will also do the narrator voice because I've been working on that voice for this other thing I'm for this thing I'm auditioning for. <clears throat> what? Yeah, I'm doing. Yeah. Uh, I'm auditioning to be a voice yeah. actor in an anime. I can't legally talk about which anime it is right now, but we'll see. Okay. <clears throat> oh. Damn. All you have to know is that it is uh, it's in the top. 25 of Crunchyroll's Japanese right now. And somehow I got an audition for the English dub. Dude, oh, okay. Is it Honor? It's Honor? I'm gonna <laughs> ask if you speak Japanese, bro. <laughs> <laughs> there. Uh, oh, also, I did sign up. I did sign up for the Last of Us edition, and I'm just waiting for a call back. Oh, my cousin uh, actually audition is getting his audition for that pretty soon too. Ah, uh, sick! Yeah, he was he was real hype. Dude, I'm just so hype, man. Last of Us is like my favorite game of all time, and now I can actually use my martial arts shit for something useful other than uh, threatening people. Breaking your body. Hey, Bro. that's uncalled for. Sure, I can't breathe out my nose, food. and sure. <laughs> and sure, my mouth. Sure, I still have trouble eating solid food sometimes, but screw off. Okay, I don't need this. A small price to pay for a black belt. Yeah, <laughs> and yeah, and none of this even happened for martial arts. I just fucking no, ran, just... I just ran into a Puerto Rican, you know, yeah, yeah. Like, like a normal person does. Of course, of course. <laughs> oh, Jay, how do you know the story in this? And he's probably just like, what the fuck is going on. <laughs> Very it was only lost. the second time he ran into something and broke his face blindfolded. <laughs> it was actually... I didn't even know Matal back then. And I hear the stories, and I see him post about it. I'm like, yo, what happened? Is everything okay? He was like... And then he explained the story, and I'm like, you fucking dumbass. Yeah. Yeah. It's a great time, man. <laughs> I still don't know why those schools made you wear blindfolds. That was actually so dumb. Uh, because white people think they're immune, and I went to a white school. Sorry about that. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> did Aiden just say sorry about that? <laughs> yeah, I did. Uh, Straight apologizing for all of it. <laughs> yeah, I... It's called reparations. So I, can, okay. <laughs> I constantly attack Aiden just because he's white. And he's accepted at I this mean, point. I'm okay with it because it's about time. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, you're not friends if you're not making... I mean, I get attacked for being white and for being Arab. I'm only one of those things, but, you know, <laughs> it is what it is. Someone, yeah, but I call you white anyways because it's hilarious. Bro, like, I have white privilege until people find out my name. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, you, you know what sucks? Okay, so people, I don't know why, people think I'm black, people think I'm Mexican. So, someone thought that I was Nigerian. And okay, that one is ridiculous. That one doesn't, <laughs> that one is ridiculous. No, <laughs> yeah, no, but you, you know what the worst thing I've been uh, classified as is? Oh, an, an old White. man, and no, an old man. Someone came up to me and asked me how old my kids were. They thought I was forty years old. Well, how old Jeez. are they? <laughs> yeah, sure. My my kids are the same age as me, but like that's no one should know that. That's their privacy, you know. God damn it! Well, it's a home matter. Yeah, god damn. God, there's no there's no privacy nowadays, which is very sad. All right, so. Um, I'll start with the narrator voice, and, uh... <clears throat> Exterior. Big blue, endless sky. Daytime. Super, 2003. Over a blue sky filled with cotton candy clouds. 
Once upon a time, in the early 2000s, there were three extraordinary sisters who were destined to save the world. Awesome. Oh, sorry. I didn't know if you were going to be reading the stage directions or not. Oh. I had no idea if you were going to do that either. Oh. I was not I was, that's what I was waiting oh. for. My oh. Oh, yeah, I'll, I'll, Is my character's name Dad? Uh, it should be something... Uh, I know it's somewhere there, but I'll find it. Oh. Cool. Uh, You'll be able to tell. You'll be able to tell. Because it's going to be like the only somewhat non I name, pretty much. Oh, 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 yeah. I'm sorry. I forgot to do the direction. All right. Blossom Utope, uh, Utonium soars up into the frame. Blossom can fly and effortlessly, even in the impractical pink dress she wears. Come on, guys. He's getting away. Blossom was the leader, the go-getter. The goody goody. Uh, Buttercup uh, Utonium flies next to her sister. She's a scrappy, scowling tomboy wearing a green dress. Come on, guys, he's getting away. Please, we always catch them. <laughs> Buttercup was the tough one, the hard ass, uh, if you'll pardon the idiom. Buttercup zooms off, a green blur bubbles Utonium in a blue dress. Pigtails and adorable smile rises up beside Blossom. I spy a camera crew. We're gonna be on TV tonight. Woot! Let's focus on finishing the job and protecting our city. Well, don't forget to smile. Daddy says her image is as important as her efficiency. She grins, touches your dimples with her index finger, and bubbles. And this is already terrible, and I love it. <laughs> I know this is garbage. <laughs> And Bubbles was a sweet, upbeat, and cheerful one, most of the time. What I get the feeling like Bubbles is going to be the crackhead, like, literally doing crack in the group. Honestly? Like, you'll assume, like, you'll <laughs> assume probably that it's going to be Buttercup, four. right? Like, you'll, you'll assume that it's going to be Buttercup, right? Because she's, like, the hard-ass, the Raphael of the group, right? But it's actually going to be the sweetest person, Butter, uh, Bubbles, just like, ha, ha, ha. And then you realize that she's literally a crackhead. <laughs> like, she's just straight, like, addicted to math by episode six. So. <laughs> <laughs> By six, she's on her. Hey, Mother, got you. Uh, you got that. You got the secret formula I need. <laughs> oh, Aiden, your character's name is Drake Utonium. So when you see Drake, Dude, that's sick. you. That's a sick ass okay. name. Hey, Who's his name Mojo? was Drake. I thought his name was just, just the professor. Ah, it's character development. That's what you get with live action, baby. Drake. What the fuck? Drake. <laughs> Drake. Drake. <laughs> The three girls dip Wait. down together, diving towards a, mari a marauding, three-headed Pegasus monster, big as a building, wrecking havoc on the city. We only see it briefly. Don't worry. Time to kick some beasts. Wow, what a line. <laughs> That's... <laughs> Give them the goddamn Emmy. They need all the awards now. <laughs> I'd like to see anybody perform that line well. And anyway, I give like I'd pay top dollar. <laughs> All right, Aiden, you try that line. Try that line. Try the try the line. Time to kick some beast. That's my best, but that's like not a Powerpuff Girl voice. It's fine. It's just if any delivery of any voice can hit it. <laughs> All right, no, get, like the Doom announcer to say like time to kick some beast. No, like, home. Give your voice. Let's go. <laughs> Time to kick some beast. <laughs> nice enunciation. Yeah, that was, I don't have a deep voice. I'm not going to lie. I wish I I'd did. I'd love to hear Kratos try to hit this lineup, you know? You need <laughs> that Kratos shit. voice actor. Are we talking about God of War 1 to 3? Or I'm assuming you mean the fourth, the new one. I'm assuming no, it's the, the, the same guy, one. dude, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, it's two different people. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, they're actually two different voice actors. I'm like 90% sure you're incorrect. Dog, I've done my research. It's two different voice actors. Damn. I Come on, now don't test me on this. All right, and I'm, I'm, I'm testing you on this. <clears throat> Time to kick some beast. That didn't work either. Fuck. Da, 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 da. She bursts ahead of them, hooking swiftly around a welcome billboard that reads, The City of Townsville, home of the Powerpuff Girls. Uh, yo, what the fuck is this word? A uh, what? Trip titch? A trip I don't know. Of brief action shots, Buttercup punching the beast, Bubbles stunning it with her ice breath, Blossom tying oh, it up. 
it's that shot where it like it breaks into three different like oh, okay. same size oh. elements where it's like the part like it's like think old classic comic books. Oh yeah, yeah. I didn't got or, it. Or actually kind of like the TV show. I guess they're kind of trying to pay homage in a way. Dude, I kinda wanna see how this I wanna see how this plays out in real live action. Holy shit. Yeah, was this supposed to be live action? Yes, it was. I and it, yes. it was. And the CW canned it after Twitter found it. Uh, good riddance. Rest in piss, bozo. These exceptional girls were not born, but created by the brilliant Professor Drake Utonium. Uh, 96, seven years earlier, Drake Utonium, a debonair scientist in his 30s, toils in a lab surrounded by mysterious equipment and colorful compounds. There is an explosion of light, red, blue, green, as new life blooms from a pipette. Pipette. On dream of being a father, but his grandiosity prevented him from pursuing this goal in the usual manner, meaning this man had no game. Drake that man is no basically. <laughs> Drake uh, didn't just want children. He wanted... Drake lifts the tinted uh, lab goggles off his face, astonished. Phenomenal. Above him, in the magic fogged air, we see the silhouettes of the hovering, newly made seven-year-old Powerpuff Girls. Why did he make them hey, seven? Yo. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. <laughs> I hate this so, so much. Drake turns to his gawky, ca- cowering uh, lab partner, Dr. Joseph Mojo. Joseph? What? Wait. Mojo? Is that JoJo's reference? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Joseph Mojo Mondel. Mojo claps as he looks a bit uncertain. Oh, who wants to play Mojo? Ah, uh, fuck it, I'll do it. Right. <clears throat> Congrats, you did it. I couldn't have done it without you, Mojo. Oh, yo, we got some viewers. We had viewers. Yeah, seven, like three. We have seven I'm people. One I'm, I'm one of them, but it was down to three like two minutes ago. I'm, I'm on there too. I have it like I have the tab muted. So okay, so there's three people other than us. <laughs> uh, interior, Professor <laughs> Utonium's house. I'm at the restaurant, so like I might be doing an order right now, but as soon as I'm done this order, I'll be like right back. Yo, this man's on his grind. He's doing voice acting and this man. God love the home. Here, give me like, give me like. Two seconds, they'll be like right back. I bet. The girls, the professor, and the professor's girlfriend, Sarah Bellum, uh, 30s, a redhead. Damn it, she's a ginger. Enjoy a cozy, laughter filled dinner. <clears throat> For years, all was well in the Utonium household. The sisters were I'm, the... I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Pause. Hold on for a sec. Did they really name her? Is, is that actually like. <laughs> Canonical that he has a, wo- a woman named Cerebellum, like like Cerebellum. Oh, I didn't even p- catch up on or pick up on that. I've been scared of shock ever since he said it. I, like, <laughs> That's funny. I can't believe they did that. Why is this a thing? <laughs> oh my god. Diablo Cody and Heather Regner, why, or Regner, why did you do this? <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, they were best of friends. Drake was a proud papa. His girlfriend, Sarah, had become, like, part of the family. Off this warm scene, we cut to... Exterior, First Bank of Townsville. Dusk. Oh, fuck. Dude, I, I, I accidentally went to the next page and they mentioned Elon Musk. What? Oh, my God. <laughs> they mentioned Elon on the next page. All right, hold on. Let's, let's wait for the home, because, like, some stupid-ass shit might go down. Yeah, we, we can just keep talking about how poorly this is going already. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just wondering about why my dude spent two dudes, my two dudes spent time in a lab and effort creating seven year old girls. Like, at least make them like, make them older to just not be creepy, you know? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know how to feel about any of this. <laughs> Yo, wait, um, uh, what was the story behind the creation in the original show? Do you guys remember? Did no, you have- God, I, no. I watched, like, the episode here or there after, like, Johnny Test. 
I thought like he just was lonely and wanted to make kids. I don't remember him having a woman. <laughs> I don't remember any Sarah I Bella. Thought, I, like I thought he was just like, man, you know what? These adoption papers are real lengthy. I could just do this myself and Thanos that shit, you know? Uh guys, um if you guys look at the chat right now, um uh one of the one of the comments spoils a little bit further ahead. Oh and, my god. Uh they say we will leak your sex tape bubbles. That's so sick. Um okay, I need it. Hold on. I have it on my computer. I can <laughs> oh my god, my home was Loki right in a couple pages. Bubbles passed out on the floor, hung over. Okay, cool. <laughs> No home was on the fucking money. <laughs> so this does get interesting. Yo, um, for all the wrong reasons. Sh should I go grab a beer and just take a drink every time something stupid happens? I think that's a good idea. All right, I'm gonna go grab a beer. You guys want anything? Ha ha ha! Get it? Cause like we're, we can't because we're, we're online. Ha ha ha! I mean, when there's a will, there's a way. You could send it over somehow. So like, I don't know why you're playing. You know, I I like uh, Aiden can tell you, I'm very very good at sports where you can throw uh, balls. I can probably throw a, a a can all the way to where you are. Yo, where you live? I'll get on my roof right now. <laughs> I'll make it easy on you. I'm coral. Yo, we we could pull it off. I'm in temple, dog. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> This is a vibe. This is a mood. Just tie it to a fucking arrow and shoot it over here. <laughs> Honestly, you would be the easiest one of everyone here. Aiden is the farthest, so um, fuck him. Yeah, yeah, you can't even. Yeah, you. Uh... Aiden's actually in yep. a cyber cafe <laughs> in the middle of fucking like Beirut right now. Uh. I could be. Don't worry, Professor. Yeah. I was an accident too. It's wait, wait, wait. What did I miss? Wait, where are we? No, we're just. We're it just... gets actually fun. All right. I, think. I don't really know. I only, I only went like one line up. So we're at the, we're at the, where it says the first bank of uh, Townsville. <clears throat> oh, okay, okay, gotcha. All right. A crowd cheering as the girls descend on villain Fuzzy Lumpkins. All right, and snatch bags of cash from his clutches. All right, no home. You do the narrator. I'm gonna go grab a beer real quick. Got you. <clears throat> the girls were beloved heroes in Townsville, a city mysteriously designed besieged by villainous creatures and crooks. Scientists, religious gurus, and conspiracy theorists all had their own explanations for why Townsville was a center for these strange attacks, but no one knew for sure. All they knew was that the Powerpuff Girls kept them safe. Inside Joseph Mojo's Mondel's, oh my goodness, why is his fucking name being weird like this? Observatory. <laughs> Reveal Mojo watching the spectacle on television in his mountaintop observatory. Oh my lord. He glares sick with envy. <clears throat> Dr. Joseph Mojo Mondel was not so delighted with the Powerpuff Girls. He resented their celebrity, especially since he'd helped, create, he'd helped Drake discover Chemical X. The mutagenic substance that gave the, the girls their power. But Drake, wrapped up in the limelight, seems to have forgotten about their decade-long partnership. I'm back. Mojo okay. turns off the TV. He walks to the window. He hoped that to use... a smooth transition. Word. It's that Brawl Hive connection, you know? You already know! Damn right. He hoped to use a chemical to gain powers himself. Powers he'd use for good. Elon... Fucking like Musk. Elon Musk. Yes. Oh, oh. Wait, powers he'd use for good like Elon, Elon Musk. How much do you think that endorsement like cost right there? <laughs> Wait. Oh my. Oh. Hold on. I'm gonna do a quick I'm gonna do a quick cross reference between the CW and Elon Musk. <laughs> Is there ref like there's gotta be some sort of correlation between Tesla and what the oh my god. At, okay, as somebody that as somebody who has actually done business with the CW, uh, let me t let me tell you guys their relationship. All right, <clears throat> there is no relationship between the CW and uh, fucking the Powerpuff Girls and Elon Musk. I have not. They probably so got why the same, they fuck him? They probably <laughs> got the same relationship that I have with the CW, which was when I accidentally walked through the set of the Flash. Literally nothing. Oh my. 
<laughs> oh, this hurts my head. I mean, I was very confused when it happened because I didn't know what I was doing. Okay. I like okay. how they call the town Townsville. <laughs> I think that's what it's called, isn't it? Well, yeah, that, at least it yeah. keeps the continuity in check. Yeah. Uh, Jason said, uh, Jason's idea is like, there were heroes as children, then got corrupted as they aged. Major Ted vibes. Honestly, yeah, probably. Yeah, someone else said, like, he wanted whatever. Daughters that were old enough to be potty trained, but not old enough to talk back. Which, honestly, I can see it. It makes more sense now. <sighs> All right. Uh, but also for his own <laughs> personal gain, like Elon Musk. But what use would it be now? Mojo wasn't cute. He didn't have any sugar or spice or anything nice. He was just a plain oh, old oh, boring okay. man. Okay, okay, okay. I didn't know we were spitting bars <laughs> on this channel. <laughs> As Mojo gazes out the window, we see three. Oh, sorry, can I? I, I don't want to derail you too bad, but if I dropped a beat, could you spit some fire? Like, could you say that line with some rain for me? <laughs> I, I, which one? Sugar? Okay. <clears throat> Let's like bring it back all the way from, from but what could uh but oh yeah but what would it be now mojo wasn't cute yeah yeah from right there all right so well, i'll drop it like a i'm waiting i'm ready what the fuck is pam in nigeria just at any point just oh oh i didn't hear anything <laughs> Oh, it's not coming through. Oh, it's because the sound gate on my fucking mic. It's not worth it. Well, the meme is dead. <laughs> All right, just just do some beatbox, and I'll, I'm ready. No, it's, it's not picking it up. It keeps cutting me out because I have a noise gate on, and I don't want to fuck with it because it will fuck with my stream. Oh there. shit, Aiden, uh, I drop a little beatbox. <laughs> oh, you know I can't do that. Exactly. Powerpuff <laughs> bars rap. Let's fucking go. I already mentioned that I'm white, bro. You know I can't do that. Um, I actually do. <laughs> uh, just in. Um, so if you have any technical difficulties, I have one thing set up on my stream right now that if you have any technical difficulties, my COVID rap will start playing. <laughs> so uh, get ready for that if you guys want to experience that shittery. <laughs> All right, so uh, where was it? All right. As Mojo gazes out the window, we see three glittery streaks of color appear in the sky. It is the girls. A boy runs from behind, nose pressed against the glass. Mojo's son, Jojo. Sick. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh I, I call Jojo. I, pains me. I call playing Jojo. <clears throat> Bro, they were patting themselves on the back so hard as they came up with this. <laughs> I can feel it. Did they come up with JoJo after Mojo, or did they come up with Mojo after JoJo? <laughs> it's, it's like, what came first, chicken or the egg? <laughs> which one spawned which? All right, guys, we have a question. Who is your favorite all-time Powerpuff Girl? Um, See, I like Blossom, but personally, we rock with Buttercup. I have go Bubbles, man. Bubbles was just so funny. I don't know why. I honestly didn't watch a lot of it growing up, so I went with Buttercup because we both got green eyes. <laughs> Oof. Aiden, what about you? Bless me. Whichever one Jason said got threatened to have their sex tape leaked, that one's my favorite. <laughs> Bubbles. Wait, Bubbles. what? Yeah, yeah apparently, apparently that happens a little bit later. Oh my! Oh! <laughs> right, let's, let's, keep going, let's keep going. Dad! Wait, what the? Wait, there it is. You're Dad! Jojo, you're Jojo. <laughs> yeah. Dad, were those the Powerpuff Girls? I really... No, wait, I need a more Jojo voice. Dad! Were those the Powerpuff Girls? I really wish I could fly. <laughs> <laughs> They're all so cool, especially Blossom. Ooh. Off Mojo Stewing. Interior, Professor Utonium's house, den, day. <laughs> the girls and Drake watch a live news broadcast. Mojo stands at a podium at a televised rally. The Chiron, Chiron, fucking bullshit. Uh, underneath reads, concerned scientists Holds anti Powerpuff rally. I was about to say something else other than Powerpuff girl. <laughs> 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 I worked with the professor for years. She's power hungry and duplicitous. He stole Chemical X from me, and I believe he may even be the mastermind behind Townsville's most heinous monsters. <gasps> How else would the girls stay famous if not from protecting us? But maybe 
We need to be protected from them. But we never. He's a sad, bitter man. Don't worry, you're more popular than ever. Drake was right. Wow. The girls have a national fan club. License, merch, link in bio, and even their own cartoon. Yo! <laughs> Did they just reference the fucking cartoon? Oh! oh my god, you guys. Next page. I'm a lesbian. I love it. <laughs> but, yeah. but Mojo wasn't their only enemy. <laughs> that is the only, only thing I actually like. That by the face an evil, a far more forbid formidable, a force that's uh, defeated uh, innumerable gifted children. <gasps> Puberty. What the fuck? Oh! <laughs> you guys have no idea how much this is physically painful. <clears throat> Oh. Close on the red oh, phone my. ringing. 2013. <laughs> Blossom. Now a teenager is lying in bed. She opens one eye. Elbows teenage buttercup who's lying next to her. We see SAT prep books scattered next to Blossom. Wake up. Red phone. Buttercup uh, takes out her own mouth guard and groans. I was up until 3 a.m. texting Rachel. Uh... <laughs> buttercup down to <laughs> see and other girls. Because you are. Yeah, but I had to put in a lot of work to convince her I wasn't. Reveals bubble Yo, passed out on the floor. Yo. Hung Yo. over! <laughs> Can someone... Hung over! Can someone please answer that thing? Buttercup flippantly picks it up and slams it back down. Where were you last night? I... Oh, she's hungover. We broke into the zoo again. We made the flamingos drink hypnotic. <laughs> Again? Oh my <laughs> Blossom has I climbed out of the bed and is putting her costume on. It's the same dress they wore as little girls. This is fucking this is what what the fuck? Do they not Come on guys, let's just suit up and get this done. I'm so oh. I'm not wearing that dress anymore. It's compulsory heterosexuality. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Say your line! <laughs> Say your line! This man's dying. Can I just get this over with? <laughs> Take it off with Dad! <laughs> Dad freaks out if we do anything off model. He treats us like a product he developed. <laughs> Why are you so angry at Daddy? <laughs> Dad, it's your turn. No, I'm sorry. I was... <laughs> oh. oh. It wasn't our idea. <laughs> it wasn't our idea to be the ordained saviors of Townsville. <laughs> oh my! Oh no! Yo, what this show has to be canceled. Cancel this show. What the fuck? <laughs> you know, time for this prep or girl drama? Let's go for it later on. Yeah. Oh my! <laughs> Bubbles dry heaves. <laughs> Blossom. Oh, <laughs> Yo, I was actually about to start dry even from laughter. Pulls Buttercup <laughs> uh, costume out of the hamper, sniffs and grimaces. Oh, oh, oh that crystal deodorant is not <laughs> <laughs> Uh Buttercup bubbles and blossoms shuffle out the front door. No, I'm Right now, bro. Are we fighting Swampy again? Who has the brief? Drake pops oh. out of the house, followed by Sarah. Bubbles, wait, where are your pigtails? You have to stick to the character Bible? <laughs> what? What Hello? is this? Oh, wait, who's playing Sarah? Oh, can I be Sarah? Go for it. She's not a character, Drake. She's gonna be real fucking sassy. I'm gonna make her I real. Know. I'm gonna make her a bitch. <laughs> That's why I've allowed her to, 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 to select two outside friends and unlimited after homeschool activities. Buttercup, why does he I don't like appreciate Kelly? the look on your face right now, bro. Can you I'm blame actually, her? Bro. She's 17 and she's up at the butt crack of dawn. <laughs> <laughs> butt crack, butt crack <laughs> of dawn. The talking swamp. <laughs> Sarah, as always, I appreciate your concern for my family. But you're not part of it. Whoa! Yo, what the fuck is this? Wait, no, didn't say like a couple lines before that she was like family? Why does he sound like R. Kelly? No. <laughs> I'm saying, bro. 
bro. It's actually weird. No, wait, hold on. It said it said she was like family, like couple lines above. It literally says his girlfriend Sarah had become like part of the family. Oh, this, when it suits I, me. This is the greatest. <laughs> <laughs> Some Omni Man level switch up. <laughs> Y'all are giving me COVID, bro. <laughs> <sighs> oh my oh. god. Before the girls can go to defend Sarah, Blossom pipes up. Blossom's not even going to defend her? What the f Guys, we have to go. Townsville needs us. Bitch, you don't go defend Sarah? Fucking dumbass bitch. Oh my fucking god. Blossom takes off from the sky. The other girls follow suit reluctantly. Sarah stares at Drake, hurt. <laughs> Come on, I'll make you an omelet while we watch the Damn. <laughs> Wait, it gets colder. Oh my fucking. Drake heads inside, no Sarah doesn't move. <laughs> We've been together for nine years. Ha, exclusive for seven. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to let me this? in here? Another nine years? Never? I can't do this anymore, Drake. Leave! Oh shit, Leave. I'm getting, I'm getting written get out, out of real class. <laughs> so, Whoa. Yo, someone Drake is like Omni Man, Future, and R. Kelly mixed all into one toxic being. I never. What yeah, is some, this? Some Black Air Force vibes. Oh, and someone read Drake? this. Someone read this. I, I, gotta, I gotta catch my breath. Someone read the name. Got narrative. you. Oh. Okay. Whew. If you search it on YouTube. Comma. Bubbles, Blossom and Buttercup battle Swampy. It's way more effortful than it should be. When suddenly, a laser beam grazes Swampy and almost hits Blossom. Reveal a giant squid robot being operated by Mojo, a lab monkey by his side. Mojo's voice bellows from a, mi a megaphone. Stop the Powerpuff Girls! Don't you see they're behind us? They're putting you all in danger! In Mojo's observatory, a teenage Jojo co-pilots his father via control panel monitor, holding a Blossom action figure. Oh, I guess I'll be JoJo since Matab is here. Dad, easy on Blossom, remember? I got this, JoJo. This fucking cringe! Back on. It is. The girls trying to subdue Swampy as few anti-Powerpuff girls, Powerpuff protesters gather below. One throws a Slurpee. Buttercup goes red hot and flies up to the jackass. I'm back. I will I will honestly end you. The people cower in fear as Mojo <laughs> blasts at Blossom again. Guys, a little help? We're working on it. Mojo blasts another laser at Swampy, hitting him in the arm and the building behind him. Concrete debris drains down. Blossom catches the falling pieces in both arms, looking to her sisters for help. The hungover bubbles can really... And those oh my <laughs> and Buttercup's <laughs> fighting with protesters. Uh, Des <laughs> Des this is receding my hairline. This is honestly causing brain cancer. <laughs> Blossom kicks a third right piece now. of debris in, out of the air, but it ricochets a lamppost, exploding into fragments. That's property damage, goddammit. Mojo's robot is riddled with shrapnel as it falls to the ground. In Mojo's lab, Jojo is speechless. His eyes water. Dad? Above the robot, Blossom sees uh, blood on the inside panel. What? Blossom and Buttercup join her. Um, Blossom begins to hyperventilate, having a full blown panic attack. Uh, a newscaster sits beside a news banner. Townsville. Divided. Wait, did In Mojo the wake of Mojo's die? death, the once fringe group of anti-power puff girls <laughs> activists have gained massive popularity in Townsville. Their goal? Oh. To banish the power puff girls. Fuck, I should have been the oh. narrator. <laughs> <laughs> the news cuts to footage of the mayor holding a press uh, conference surrounded by angry anti-power puff protesters. Aiden, you're the mayor. Okay. Due to public safety concerns, the Powerpuff Girls have been outlawed from fighting in Townsville. <laughs> the protesters cheer wildly as... Uh, da -da, Bubbles and Buttercup watch on TV under a blanket together. I'd better check on Blossom. Uh, and Blossom's room, Buttercup enters Blossom's room. 
Loss. Oh god. <laughs> the bed is empty oh! and made. Oh! Empty drawers are open. I see a tear-stained blossom flying as fast as she can through an overcast sky, a suitcase strapped to her back. A now furious buttercup bursts angrily out at the front door and is immediately swarmed by news cameras. Oh, do I? Does she, okay, wait. Does it censor her, or do you think <laughs> that she's going to be saying the word bleep? Um, <laughs> you know, you know, I will let you take creative, I'm, take creative freedom. I'm, oh, can I? Can I? Okay, I'm gonna, is it cool if I drop some? So I've been avoiding dropping too many big swears on your stream. Is that cool? Oh, go crazy! As long as they're within the guidelines, go for it. You <laughs> was because okay, I'm not saying bleep. <laughs> Fuck you all and fuck Townsville. The Powerpuff Girls are done. All right, cool. That's the end of uh, the show. All right, cool. <laughs> <laughs> Wrap it up, boys. Oh, no, wait. There's oh, more. There's more. That was the that was the teaser. Yeah, this is that was the nothing. teaser. What? Okay. <clears throat> fuck. Wait. Smoke billows from the first floor of a house. Narrate. After Blossom ran away to build a new life for herself, Buttercup and Bubbles followed suit. On the second floor, a window opens. Adult Buttercup, wearing firefighter gear, leaps out the window with a little boy in her arms. They fly down 20 feet and land gently. Enraged by the ign ignoble end of the PPGs. What the fuck are the PPGs? Buttercup hey man, PPGs sucks. for life. <laughs> Wait, how would you say gang sign? PPGs? Yeah. I don't even want to attempt anything, anything with this bullshit. She moved to a small town in Oregon, shortened her name to B, and to organized a fire department, convincing herself that she could be a happy as a normal human hero. Oh, other little boy. I thought you guys use ladders. <clears throat> if anybody asks, I did. Want to see me put out the fire with the magic ice breath? The little boy nods, excited. As Buttercup inhales, another firefighter comes around the side of the house with a hose. Maybe next time. Goddamn cock tease. This shit seems Whoa. very much like Incredibles. <laughs> but, like, not good. But, like, yeah, uh, way worse. Incredibles. No Pixar moms. Incredibles and is the yeah, greatest no thing ever. Helen Parr. I Bro, like I need a Pixar like mom in my life right now. I feel like I feel like Sarah is supposed to be that MILF that we're all looking for, but I guarantee you they're gonna cast someone mid to play as Sarah. I guarantee it, or your money back. <laughs> I just need me a Miss Incredible in my life, not on God. Wait, uh, someone, Anyways, someone go on Google and see, and see if they had the cast list for this. I want to see who played Sarah. Uh, because uh, 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 oh. they did fully cast the show. Our Girls. It was a show, not a movie. Oh, dude, this is a dude. Uh, it looks terrible. Uh, Jennifer Martin. Jam is Google her real quick. Jennifer Martin. Is she hot? Let's see. Let's or maybe see. that's the original voice actor. Actually, my bad. Ooh. Yeah, that's the original voice actor. I'm not finding. Damn, we don't know who the uh, hell this is. Uh, all right, yeah, I'm not they finding that. To listen, listen to this boy. Listen to you. <laughs> you understand the connotation is there being a my lord Mojo Jojo. Is, I can't. Oh is he breaking off for everybody else too? Yeah. Yeah. He is. yeah. Miss Bell. No, home. Your Wi-Fi is cut. Am I breaking up? Yeah. Hold on. Can you hear me? Now we can. Am I good? Yeah. Now we can. Okay, okay, yeah. They're, apparently, they're casting Miss Bellum to be some hot mid. Uh, Robin Lively. Yeah, I just was looking at that right now. Rob, Robin Lively. Fuck. No way, the dude from yeah, see, Scrubs was gonna be the as professor. As <gasps> oh my god. Wait, Zach Braff? Yeah. No, 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 no. Donald Faison? Donald Faison. <gasps> yeah. Oh! Turn! Yep. <gasps> This show, okay, I love this show now. I love Turk. I love everything that he's in. Ooh, I'm excited. No, not this, bro. Listen, listen, listen. I have They're to. They're casting a black man to play a toxic, manipulative, R. Kelly-like role. Yeah, but Do you this... you see the issues with this? This is Sarah. <laughs> this is Sarah, though. So, you know. <laughs> this is something, I guess. Wait. Yeah, there's... Oh. 
Yo, she, oh uh, god. Oh, yeah. oh, I'm just reading the oh I'm reading what the narrator says next. Oh my goodness. Oh oh yeah. Uh on the license plate, bubbles mm. one with a Z, uh, affixed to a baby little Corvette, a doll bubble still uh, wearing her signature pigtails. Pops the trunk is full of Powerpuff Girls merch and a priceless oh selfies twenty dollars. T-shirts thirty. Selfie and shirt forty five. All right, that's actually a good deal to be honest. Good, good oh. capitalism. Bubbles went to Hollywood hoping to capitalize on her childhood fame. Macaulay Culkin vibes. After two stints in rehab, yeah, real Macaulay Culkin I vibes. It. I fucking called it. <laughs> Three failed yeah, reality show it. pilots. <laughs> she what? has privilege to direct sales. Bubbles announces herself to a pack of passing tourists. I'm Bubbles from the Powerpuff Girls. No, actually, no. Because because she's not kind of a crackhead now. I'll do a crackhead. I'll do a Snooky kind of voice. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Bubbles from the Powerpuff Girls, the real Bubbles, unlike that Bobo knockoff. Wonder what the fuck is a Bobo knockoff? Wonder Woman. Oh. <laughs> oh. Fake Wonder, Wonder Woman, Woman turns and sticks her tongue out of Bubbles as the Taurus block to her. Oh my fucking god, this, oh. this is the best thing ever. Blossom sits in a lecture hall taking notes. As for Blossom, she attended an elite women's college in the Northeast. Northeast Calgary represent. Collecting <laughs> degrees yes, to cocoon herself from the harsh sting of the real world. It was effective. She spots a Powerpuff tattoo on the bicep of a classmate. Most of the time. 2021. Yo, I want to see, tr- see a Trump reference somewhere here, man. <laughs> All right. Blossom joins her adorable boyfriend, Clive. Fucking Clive. Clive. As uh, as Blossom enters, she puts a birthday hat on her head, smiling. After a decade of school, Blossom got a job at a Boston area biotech firm where she met her boyfriend, Clive. This morning, they're celebrating her 25th birthday, which is technically tomorrow. But tomorrow, Blossom has uh, some out-of-town business to attend to. Ding! A reminder text from the Spirit Airlines pop-ups. You can fly. Why would you want Spirit Airlines? Wait, Spirit. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Time out, time out, time out. A, she can fly. You're right. B, out of any airline that you would choose, Spirit Airlines, the most ratchet ghetto version of an airline. Isn't Spirit Airlines the one with the Burger King guy? <laughs> I think so. <laughs> also, uh, just some some Calgary news right now. Apparently, in Arbor Lake, there's a tactical police unit with eight cars in a row. So, uh, so you know, we'll see what's happening there. That's far from my end, but like, shit. <laughs> Ask Raja. Yeah, no, Raja just sent me that. Oh, it's time to check in for your flight to Townsville, departing tomorrow at eight a.m. She, she shudders. I don't want to go to Townsville. Clive rubs her shoulder warmly as he pours her coffee. Oh, once we Clive. Yeah, I'm gonna feel real uncomfortable if anyone else, anyone else besides myself, voices Clive. Actually, Clive. I'll, okay, I'll be Clive then. <clears throat> After this I weekend, so much. you never have to, you never have to again. Once you sign the document, collect your trust fund, you're free. Besides, you've been so excited to see your sisters after all this time, baby. Clive's after the bread. Clive is after the bread. That's yeah. his first line. <laughs> Maybe I waited too long. I've been so missing in action. <laughs> Buttercup and Bubbles talk all the time. Buttercup even went out to see Bubbles' one woman show, Bubbles with a Chance of Bubbles. <laughs> Bars! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Babe, you had a messed up childhood that, that culminated in a traumatic event. It sounds like your, your therapist says you need to go out and make your own way in the world for the sake of your mental health. Fucking chill out, Clive! What? Oh my. Fucking stop Why are they forcing, Clive. They're forcing this so much. <laughs> I hope I don't have a panic attack while I'm there. If you, <laughs> if you do freak out, just do that exercise Mr. Pat taught you. Right. Visualize my inner child. That obviously will not help you. Dude, I'm picturing real people ha- having a conversation right now. Even in front of a camera. That's I just... I'm trying, it's, but I it's can't. Impossible. She gazes into the middle distance where her childhood self magically appears. Waving to her reassuringly. 
Thanks for being amazing, Clive. I love you. I, I hate this so much. I love you too, baby doll. <laughs> Matov, I will break your nose for the third time. Come at me, baby. I can't breathe anyways. <laughs> It's all cosmetic at this point, and the doctor says that if I get plastic surgery, <laughs> it won't do anything because I could possibly, oh. yeah, I could die during a plastic surgery. So my nose is screwed forever. Ha oh, cool. Yes, nice. sir. Thank you. I always win. Ding. Damn, I can't even say anything. <laughs> yeah. Uh, another text, this time from Bubbles to both Buttercup and Blossom. It says, Happy birthday, Eve, my BBs. See you tomorrow. Blossom soothed by her, by her conversation with Clive. Grins and texts back. I can't wait to see. Oh, wait, that's you. Can't wait to see you guys. Seriously. After a beat, Buttercup texts. Me three. It's gonna be super fun. And government oh. building uh, to establish day JoJo. <clears throat> Damn it! Demonstrate to hell, Gina. <laughs> Jojo, uh, also now in his 20s, sits in a well-appointed office. A plaque on his desk reads, Jojo model. Fucking tear, a mayor of Townsville. He reads through a report in front of a, se for a secretary, Gina. Aiden, you are Gina. And he has a pet monkey sitting on his desk. I might have to dip. You bastard. Yeah, oops. I bet, okay... You have to leave right now? Yeah, I mean, yeah, pretty much. Okay, I love you. I'll see you tomorrow anyways. True. Deuces, cool. Aiden. It was nice meeting you. See ya, yeah. Good talking to you, boys. I, I'll see you in, like, fucking 12 hours, maybe. No, like, 18 hours. Eight. All right. Yeah, peace. Peace. Deuces. All right, who wants to play Gina? Uh, I guess I'll do it. Uh, da -da 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 -da. this is just internal polling data. You've got time to pull ahead. Unlike our particle uh, power puff, uh, Mojo's son, Jojo, stayed in Townsville. Indeed, his dedication to the city had carried him all the way to public office. He was the youngest person ever elected mayor of Townsville. Unfortunately for him, a second term looks unlikely. <clears throat> Wait, this man's in his 20s and he's the mayor? Yeah. Uh, he has a political science degree, you know. So me and a home are right on track. So like, I, like he finished school and then became a mayor. Yes, exactly. Okay, continue. <laughs> All right, I, I gotta do the voice properly. <clears throat> I've delivered on everything I promised, except free gelato Fridays, and that's only because the perfect scoop turned out to be a front for meth trafficking. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Alicia Lawrence has no experience. She's impulsive and reactionary. She's exciting. You mean she's not a white man? Wait, uh, I've been trying to say what? No, no, actually, I've been trying to say I've been trying to say the the line a white man in my, my uh, Jerry Seinfeld voice. <clears throat> I already know why you're trying to say it. No, that's that's the part. No, because like he says it in uh, the B movie, like the B movie. I know. All right. <clears throat> You mean, because she's not a white man? That's, yeah, that's straight to Seinfeld. You know, you know why it's telling me to cringe? I didn't need it to tell me that. I was only doing that. <laughs> you, you hear about the, you hear about the reverse discrimination until it happens to you. Dude, is, is Jojo played by a white man? Or who's playing Jojo in the show? I kind of wish he wasn't. It'd be funny if he just said that but wasn't white. Like, yeah. <laughs> just make it a comedy, bro. Yeah. No offense. You totally earned your position. Optics don't hurt, though. He's actually just like Filipino. <laughs> Gina, say your line. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> There is one thing people love more than virtue signaling, Gina. Frozen desserts of Italian origin? No. Security. Safety. And I can provide that. Jojo feeds his monkey a treat. Oh my god. No, he doesn't. No, he fucking doesn't. <laughs> With all due respect, Mr. Mayor. Oh, I, if I'm saying Mr. Mayor, I'm putting on the other voice. With all due respect, Mr. Mayor, Townsville is a candy-colored... <laughs> 
a candy-colored bubble of privilege and comfort ever since the creatures attack, sto uh, creatures attack stopped by one of America's safest cities. I don't think the people are voting for him out of place of... I don't think people are voting from a place of fear, for fuck's sake, I can't read. <laughs> <laughs> what about my pet monkey? That was meaningful in the last election. There's no way! There's no way! There's no way! No one cares anymore. <laughs> Post Harambe, bro. Post Harambe! <laughs> oh! Oh! Oh, this can't be real. This cannot be real. Dude, this stream is so much more people because it's just so fucked. I hope they do a flashback to pre Arambe and pre Harambe and cast him. Like, I gotta see which gorilla they cast to play Harambe. I want a prequel series right now. I need to read through all of this. Go ahead and knock off for lunch. CW's the Harambe. <laughs> Oh. Oh. Uh, one more thing. The Powerpuff Girls are coming to town tomorrow. The color drains from his... So wait, so Jojo is colored. Okay, this is... This is good. This is good. Tomorrow, all three? Uh, just for the weekend, the Gazette called asking for, the com for comment. Tell Frank I said no comment. That'll be all. Such a badass line. Gina nods, exits as Jojo mauls over all over this. Uh, his monkey screeches. Um, it gives Jojo an idea. He picks up his cell, pulls up a contact, short stack, heads for a moment, and dials. I need you. Uh, Buttercup. No, 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 no. And I miss you. <laughs> and now I wonder. <laughs> Uh, Buttercup exits with her duffel. We see Bubbles with her sweet or suite of luggage in line for an Uber. They probably paid a fuck ton for that. Mm -hmm. uh, she's accompanied by a middle-aged guy with a camera. You know why I thought I was going to say Middle Eastern? <laughs> it's like, what do they got to say about me? <laughs> she spots Buttercup heading over. Here she comes. Start filming. Buttercup, happy birthday, bitch! <laughs> oh! They hug happily until Buttercup notices the cameraman. What's with who is that? Al Mazel. Masels. What's with Al Masels over here? Does he work for Bravo? No, I'm making tasteful talk about my comeback slash solo career, which start. Wait, wait, sorry, I'm doing, I'm, I'm doing a. A crackhead voice. Nah, I'm making a tasteful dog about my comeback slash solo career, which starts with capturing our reunion, which is kind of a big D. Oh, and this is my manager, Ace. Hey. <laughs> Let's just make him a burnout. Let's just make him a waste man burnout. <laughs> uh, Buttercup. Uh, when you say reunion, to be clear, you mean like personal reunion because I'm not. Uh... You're not interested in a re team or a reboot of the Powerpuff Girls? I know. Even though America will go rip shit bonkers for it. They would. <laughs> Buttercup affectionately strokes one of bu bu Bubbles' pigtails. You haven't changed at all. Winks? Ha! Got us. Uh. Gotta stick with the character Bible. Oh, speaking of character Bible, do you guys know about the character Bible of Sonic? Dude, it's fuck. Huh? Uh, the character Bible of Sonic is so fucking hilarious. Like, um, his name is actually something like Scotty or something. And he has a, uh, his parents were murdered in like, um, in like a nuclear, uh, nuclear attack or some shit. It was so stupid. I'll send you guys a video afterwards, but it's so fucked. It's amazing. Cool. Uh, they smirk, uh, but the looks they exchange are poignant. Bubbles, Buttercup, and Ace ride in the back of an Uber. Okay, just Uber, not even Uber X or... Wow, so they're going pretty cheap right now. They pass the old yeah. Welcome to Townsville billboard, which now just says, Jojo Mondel, mayor, with a smiling photo of Jojo. So Mojo's son is the mayor now. Remember what a huge crush he had on Blossom? Weird kid. Hey, you know who we should go see while we're here? Sarah! She was always so great to us. I blew that one. Yeah, now she just date now he just dates randos, 
Beaner Bunkies and Science Hoes. <laughs> what? Beaker Bunky Bunnies and Science Hoes? Beaker Bunnies and That sounds Science like my Hose. next mixtape right there. <laughs> that sounds like a mixtape name. Beaker Yo, Bunnies Beaker and Science Hoes. Beaker Bunnies and Science Hoes. All right, right. All right. Uh, someone drop a beat. I got this. <sighs> yeah, you can, you can beatbox. I can. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but like the voice meter fucks it up, like you won't be able to hear it properly. <laughs> Alright, Nahom. I, I know home, I need you to do this. You know I can drop bars easy, like that's not a problem. Alright, All right. you, you know what? I'll, I'll drop a beat, you drop bars. Are you playing it on uh, your Twitch? On your stream? <laughs> uh, I'll do the... I'll, I'll beatbox it, you know? I got oh, the okay. skills. What am I? Okay, I'm, I'm rhyming both. Beaker bunnies of science. Oh, it's, okay. <laughs> Yeah, see, even that's cutting out a bunch. Like, I can't hear a beat. Fuck! All right, whatever. Uh, Buttercup looks out the window, and she sees Townsville Gifts, a shop still selling Powerpuff Girls souvenirs. Look, they rejected us, but they're still hawking our merch. Pathetic. We put this town on the goddamn map, like the aliens in Roswell. Or witches in Salem. The car turns. Oh, my lord. They're referencing the witch. Yeah. <gasps> yes. Uh... I can't believe Blossom is coming. She's been a total ghost aside from the obligatory holiday text. Hey, that's a oh. lie. <laughs> oh, fuck. I'm sorry. It's all good. I'll continue from there. Yeah, it's probably only because Dad made it, to ma made it mandatory for us to be here for IRL to access the trust. So what are you going to do with the money? Buy a little cabin, rescue a few skanoodles or doodles. Schnoodles <laughs> or doodles? <laughs> oh, my God. Uh... uh. Why is it just but like I'm not a total oh, the line Wait what what line? <clears throat> Keep, just read it just read it uh, I'm not a total a, cliche a I'm going to have I'm going to have chickens too suddenly they all look oh, okay Suddenly looked at the window <laughs> alarmed What the fuck Zilumpkins Oh my oh, god. god We see a mob of people oh. gathered near the Powerpuff Girls childhood home Some are pressed and some carry signs uh, uh, say, say things like, no violence in Townsville, we scant, a scant few are fans. That alerted the press. The sisters get out of the Uber, a small crowd surrounds them, yelling questions. Are you here to start trouble? No, uh, you want to be a journalist? Are the Powerpuff Girls we teaming? Hell no. I'm not capping for Townsville ever again. <laughs> Caping, I think it meant. Yeah. But I'm reading it as capping. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here to collect the debt, then I'm out. Throttle down, boo! <laughs> Your Kevax is going. I'm losing. Who is this? I'm losing my will to live right now. Reveal a cute little girl standing by the front door. Uh, oh, I'll put your head up. <clears throat> oh, wait, this is a little girl. Hello, I'm Henrietta. I'm a huge fan. Blossom is my favorite, but you're all feminist icons. Thank you, cutie. Can I have a hug? Bubble leans down to hug Henrietta. Uh, Buttercup notices a large furry caterpillar on Henrietta's shoulder, arcing up towards Bubble's ear. She instinctively swats the caterpillar into the bushes. Henrietta bursts into tears. Into full panic, that was my pet Gloria! Buttercup begins to mumble an apology as... Daddy! <laughs> uh, camera shutters, uh, click as Drake opens up the door to meet his daughter. Bubble uh, hugs him, Ace films, Aiden's not here, who wants to play Drake? I got Girls. it. Girls! Okay, you go for it, no, I don't it. want to. <laughs> I bet, bet, bet. Girls! Buttercup strides past Drake inside the house. As Drake shuts the door behind Buttercup and Bubbles. Dad, why'd you call the press? Blossom's gonna freak out and the last thing we need is another crack in the bell jar. Blossom's fine. I saw her Insta that she has a boyfriend. I saw on her LinkedIn that she got promoted. And I saw on Facebook oh. that she still talks to Grandpa despite their political indifferences. Which means Grandpa, Grandpa? Grandpa is against... <laughs> Grandpa supports Israel. Grandpa for sure supports Israel. <laughs> Coming back here is probably triggering for her. <laughs> oh, oh, 
Why? Because she's oh. the one who killed Mojo. I mean, moveon.org. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> I like that it's dot org because that means it's a non for a non for profit. Like that's really cool. Yeah, that's actually that's actually pretty chill. You know, I gotta respect that. You know. Yeah, that's some respect. I Good don't... job, there, CW. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, see, oh. we hear a ch- off off camera. We hear a chair squeak. It's Blossom sitting at the kitchen table. Awkward. Ace turns to Drake, extends his hand. Oh. Ace is gone now, huh? Um, wait, who was Ace? Or were you Ace? Oh, no, you did that. Was it? Was I? Am I? Oh yeah, no. Oh yeah, I was being a burnout. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Ace Virgo management. Drake uh, shakes his hand as Blossom rises to greet her sisters. Come here. <laughs> <laughs> Buttercup and Bubbles coming for a long, strong group hug. Drake watches them, please. He then then he turns to Ace, who has temporarily lowered his camera to observe the reunion. You getting this? Uh, the sisters sit in one side of the dinner table. Drake's uh, on the other side. Room is filled with uh, birthday balloons. Ace keeps filming. I can't believe you girls are 25. Ow. The three... Bees back in Townsville. <sighs> It'll be nice to catch up, huh? Blossom is looking at a red phone dis- uh, on display in a glass a case, like a museum piece. She starts downing a glass of wine. Yes, and it'll be nice to collect the money we sold our childhoods for. Where do we sign? You love being a Powerpuff girl. It's not like we had a choice. Bloss, you loved it. You were always the first one at the door when that alarm went off. Yes, the alarm. I'm sure there's no use for it now that the scariest thing in Townsville is uh, Hobby Lobby. Actually, I didn't want to bring this up yet, but I have a, I have reason to believe that a darkness may be returning. Dad, you don't mean like... Monsters? Blossom begins to hyperventilate. It's a panic attack. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm dying inside from this. We're a third way there, boys. Oh, oh god. I think the city may need the Powerpuff Girls again. Oh my fucking god. Off oh, Blossom losing consciousness. Bloss? He fucking passes out. <laughs> Alright, Henrietta is in an apartment and in a child-sized desk. Sorry, wait, wait, wait. Did that just say Henrietta's lair? Yeah. Yeah, what the fuck? Yeah, obviously the caterpillar is an evil genius who's oh. who's obviously hell-bent on destroying it's the power of us. It's a robot. I'm pretty sure Henrietta is actually a villain. It's a fucking a robot! The, the caterpillar is a robot, y'all. Reveal there are hundreds of ca- robot caterpillars crawling around the room. Henrietta cranks the volume on her record player. Hey, turn it down! Sorry, Mr. Carruthers. Henrietta pushes one of her woolly bears through a wall vent. Oh. Uh, Mr. Carruthers uh, watches UFC... On his couch, the woolly bear emerges from his vent and traverses across the couch cushions before crawling to its eater. Oh, fuck. A crother shakes his head at first and quickly sells into his new normal. A strange yellow glint in his eyes. He has jaundice. That's a, that's a not good. Glowworm continues to play faintly as we... And that's the end of Act 1. Oh, there's still more! Oh, my fucking God. All right. I think we just speed round this. Let's do it. <clears throat> Bloss was out cold. Bubbles and Buttercup hover over her. Bloss, wake up or we'll leak your nudes everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> what did I do? I worked on you once. Bubbles not. <laughs> Remembering then thinks. <laughs> Closes her eyes. Oh, fuck. <clears throat> Grew up in a small town and when the rain would fall down, I just stare out my window. Please, not break away. It's working! Dreaming of what could be, and if I'd end up happy, I would pray I would break away. Okay, I'm up. Too late. Are you ready? One, two, 
three. I'll spread, spread my, wings my wings and I'll, and I'll learn how, how to fly. fly. I'll do what it, do what it takes, takes until I, I touch, the, touch sky. the sky. Beautiful. Beautiful. I'm losing my will to exist on this planet from this script. Dude, uh, after I'm done this stream, I'm going to clip the fuck out of this shit. This is going to be beautiful. Oh, you had to, yo, the amount of clips that you could take from this stream. Oh, my oh, lord. My lord, yes. Uh, the sisters find Drake dancing in front of a PowerPoint, eating a gogurt. He accidentally drips some on his shirt. Uh, da -da -da. Well, it's a good I, thing I have this uh, this fucking tied to go watch. That's gonna be the next sad <laughs> placement. Sorry, girls. I have a condition where if I see someone faint, I faint. So I had to grab some sugar. Notices the gogurt. Stage. You couldn't wake up your now, fucking daughter. That? Take a seat, please. I made cocoa. This. What the fuck is this? Bubbles Damn. happily sits. Matab, Matab, Matab. Yes. Matab. Okay. Chat disclaimer. I am Ethiopian, all right? I am black. Who the fuck is this nigga, bro? <laughs> I'm so tired. Oh, I'm so tired of Drake, bro. This man is actually pissing me off. Oh, oh my goodness. Bubbles happily sits, butter cup and blossom, take a seat. Damn. I do love that cocoa. And I love family time. Drake shuts the door with a remote as the girls sit. On the PowerPoint, a graph with various squiggly lines. <clears throat> as you girls may or may not know, I've been monitoring supernatural evil activity here in Townsville ever since you left. Mostly, it's a lot of dead ends and conspiracy. Until this morning, when I saw this! You know what we should have done for this? We should we uh we like you you know those like uh spinny wheel things you like, people use for like those competitions and shit. Uh, we should have done that for each of the characters. Each person gets a character, and then a different way to enunciate that character. You know. Oh, that would have been oh fun. Yeah. Oh my god, that'd be hilarious. Yo, one day, one day, we, one day we should do another script reading of some other fucking show or something, and just do that shit. That'd be hilarious. I'm so Bro, down. I, I'm so down. <laughs> can we read uh next time if you're down for a script? I have the absolute funniest script ever written by my high school theater teacher that I was like one of the main uh, cast in, and to this day, it is one of the funniest fucking things I've read. It is filled to the brim with sexual innuendo. I am so down. Yep. It's Let's called do Head. It. Oh, dude! If, if, <laughs> dude, if Aiden was here, <laughs> holy fuck! <laughs> Bro, it's called Head. You want to hear the most awkward shit, though? Yes. It's what? three guys and two girls in this whole play. And the three guys are like, two of them are essentially the, the leads. I was one of the two. Um, the guy who I was acting across was gay. And his previous boyfriend was the third guy in the play. So there was some tension oh, there. God. And then out of the two females oh. that were there, <laughs> one of them was my ex. So it was... Oh god! A, a hectic play, and it was all sexual innuendo. So it was so fucking. But like me and my ex were cool. It was just awkward. It was just funny as fuck. Oh, beautiful! I love it. Drake pulls up a picture of a missing kitten. Posts on next door. Blossom squints. Uh, Buttercup rolls her eyes. So cute. I want it in a frame. Sorry, sorry. Wrong thread. Bear with me. And here we are. Drake. Uh, pulls up another next door thread titled is anyone else's interest internet fucked with several complaints Yeah, this makes a lot more sense My dear buttercup. It's not the what but the why I Investigated and the providers are not to blame. There's no explanation for is why this entire episode based on shitty Wi-Fi I think so. Block radius doesn't have working internet except <laughs> For a mysterious, unusual concentration of high-frequency technology nearby, suggesting evidence of an evil, se a secret, evil laboratory. This is the greatest fucking show ever. I am losing my will to live from this. Yo, no home. Did you send this? Uh, the link to this to the group chat. Oh, I should do that right now. Oh, did you tweet the link? Uh, I, I, I'm pretty sure I did. Let me just double. Wait. Check. Go check. Cause I will retweet that shit. I did, yeah. Da, 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 yeah. <laughs> Bubbles gasps with excitement. Buttercup rolls her eyes. 
Uh, that might be scary if you didn't say it like a cruise ship MC. The reach of the outage suggests some pretty heavy duty tech. I didn't want to let. I didn't want to get too close under men, or should I say, under girls. I hate this so much. You I shouldn't. <laughs> Uh, this is fucking beautiful uh, so you want oh yes so you want us to go see if there's an evil lab based on a thread from next door about spotty internet uh huh okay I just want to say one thing uh, I, I, I promise you guys the script for my movie is not as bad as this fucking like catastrophe <laughs> I, yeah, me too. Talk, I promise you, if your movie script is this bad, I'm letting you know, and I'm, oh my lord, I'm cooking it every single line. I hope you realize that, dude. This I know it's not. <laughs> I know it's not. Same goes for mine. Mine's not trash either. Well, it is, but it's not like it's not this level of trash. Oh, dude. Oh fuck, man. Now, now I have to. I'm gonna have to reread my script after this, just to make sure nothing. Sh- but see, the thing is, like with my scripts, though, none of my scripts are ever like definite with dialogue. It was just like a rough outline, and then we just like do everything in the moment, so it sounds more natural, you know. So no, nothing mm-hmm. fucked like this shit. Yeah, I feel that. Yeah, I don't know. With every video I make, I hate, I hate, I hate scripts. I uh, if, if it's a play or anything, I always hate scripts. That was bullshit, in my opinion. Amen. Uh, Buttercup. Oh, sorry, I was retweeting you. Oh, okay. Um, where am I? Uh, and. And you're sure this evidence isn't something you staged in order to drum up a comeback for us? Honey, you think I would lie to you? Yes, you lie all the time. Remember when you let that colossal gopher out during sweeps? That was one time. You were in a ratings hole. And we ended up in a literal hole created by a giant gopher who tried to kill us with a tree trunk. Now that was good TV. Okay, well, I'm gonna pass. Yeah, same. Ooh, Blossom gets it. Uh, Bubbles gets a little monologue. Uh, Drake pouts, Bubbles stands up, turns to his sisters. Guys, how can you turn down an evil uh, recall mission? Especially when uh, said Mish will make a perfect storyline for my documentary. Bubbles is back, bitches. Not to be confused with your other film, Bubbles on her back. <laughs> Come on, it'll be come on, it'll be fun. Plus, we haven't hung out in like a decade, bitches. I really miss us. Please. We do have a day to kill before we get our monies, and maybe there'll be something for me to beat up. Totally. Yeah, this was somehow written in 2020 and also in 20 fucking 13 somehow. <sighs> I don't get it. Totally Blossom, evil recomish. The sister looked at Blossom, she looks away, ashamed. Blossom? No sound. He there, uh, como va? a man, Mr. Do, most do, do, wanted, do, do, do. Mr. Most wanted ah, podcast. Are you there? Uh, chat, please drop a hashtag. Where's in the home? Can we get that trending, please? I'm worried. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, Spotify, please uh, found him. This is all the copyright music in his podcast. I'm coming after him. Uh, all right, it's fine. All right, I'll, I'll take Blossom for a bit. I, <laughs> I think I'm just gonna nap, take a nap. Buttercup rolls her eyes. Bubbles takes a deep breath. <gasps> we grew up in a small town. Get it, Bubs. Let her have her boring phone sex with her pasty boyfriend. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> uh, wait, is no home Drake? Uh, I'll take Drake. Uh, okay. Girls don't fight. How about Buttercup go stays goes with Bubbles and Blossom stays with me? We haven't had any QT since you got home. Blossom shuts her eyes, takes a deep breath. When she opens them, she sees young Blossom examining chemicals in the BG. Ooh, young Blossom. 
You can't do this. It's just Dad. Blossom eyes a gogurt stain on Dad's shirt. Cut to a uh, Blossom drives. Uh, Wait, what the fuck was that supposed to be? I have no like idea. reference to because I don't like that. I have no idea what the fuck's going on. Why is she having like bad flashbacks when she saw a gogurt stain? Like, what? What is that? What is that reminding her of? I, uh, I hate this. I think this is all uh, for brand recognition. That's my guess. <laughs> gogurt will stain the shit out of your fucking clothes. Good luck, buddy. <laughs> Blossom drives, buttercups in front, bubbles in the back, with Ace examining uh, Drake's stats on an iPad while Ace films. Okay, so this pawn tech evil lab dad found is somewhere between donut, donut thing and the volcano. Oh, that's interesting. What the not, no one cares. Oh, no home said he'll be back as soon as he gets home. I right, cool, cool. The Kano's owned by the Rowdy Rough Boys, three brothers who were a failed spin-off version of us. Except they had no superpowers, and they got all Louis Pearl... Oh, Louis Pearlman. <laughs> <laughs> Their reference game is off the fucking charts. <laughs> Dude, they're, they're doing more outside reference than the fucking Marvel movie, man. Yeah, like, Jesus, how much money did they need? <laughs> the, the fucking effects would have been through the roof, or at least they fucking better have been. Yo, this probably, this might have, this has the same fucking budget as, like, the fucking new uh, Avatar movie. A billion dollar budget. <laughs> if, the ra if the Rowdy Rough Boys have turned their evil in hopes uh, of rebooting their franchise and we stop them, then maybe Townsville will want us back. Yo, is this like a fucking, just like a shitty version of the boys? I think so. My fucking god damn. Blossom exhales deeply, Buttercup turns towards Bubbles. Let me tell you something. When we got outlawed by Townsville for accidentally killing a madman and then unceremon unceremoniously ditched by Blossom, I was pissed. Blossom shifts in her seat, guilty and annoyed at the dig. But it forced me to reevaluate my life. And I realized how exhausted I was defending myself against misogynist morons and pretending it, and pretending I was straight for the cameras. It was fun when it was when eh, it was fun when it was about fighting baddies, but it changed. Now she's fighting baddies in a different way. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it did. Yeah, what the fuck is this, dude? I'm just trying to figure out. Okay, how did they think this was a good script? How did they think it was fucking acceptable? <laughs> like, did they not watch the original shit? You know? I'm just trying to figure that out. Yo, I barely did, and I know this is garbage. <laughs> do you guys think JoJo would do an interview for my doc? You know, I don't think he would because of the whole we killed his dad thing. Did you really want, I really want a scene of uh, Bubbles and JoJo just to see how I can manage those two fucking voices back to back. Amazing. Boss, maybe you can ask for me. I bet he's still obsessed with you. He was never obsessed with me. Uh, yeah, he was, and I bet he still is, but in a kinky, angry <laughs> way. Ooh, that's a good space. Yo, what the f- Why what is this a thing? There. <laughs> yeah, dive bar, blossom, uh, bubbles, and the whatever, the- Enter this volcano, a picture of the rowdy rough boys. Brick, Boomer, and Butch. Oh, these guys sound like the biggest assholes though. Alright. Oh, sure. Alright, who do you do you wanna be who do you wanna be of the three? Uh I guess I don't know, I'll be Butch. Alright, I'll take uh Boomer and Brick until Nahome gets back. Cool. Alright. <clears throat> Butch. Butch, now a super hot bartender. Oh, that's nice. He's hot now. Uh, gives Aww. Buttercup and Blossom big hugs. Butch gets the bubbles and frowns. Standoffish. Where's my hug? Last time I saw you, you broke off our engagement and told me you pawned the ring for drugs. <laughs> what the fuck? Jesus. <laughs> Was that you? Buttercup elbows her. Have a drink with us. We'll never, uh, we're never here. It'll never, and never will be again. 
Okay, one shot. Oh, those for me. Thank you. <laughs> Butch leaves grabbing the drinks. Parker makes eyes at the hot girl at the bar, Macy. Oh my fucking god. Aren't we here to investigate? I'm here to. <laughs> I'm here to pick up five curious townies. <laughs> You're here to avoid Drake. Bubbles is here to investigate, but she forgot Butch hates her. Luckily, we're dealing with another hate boner, so alcohol helps. What the fuck is this show? Why do you know so much about hate boners? <laughs> Life is one big hate boner. What that was that was the word hate boner way too many times. 